And now we're invincible. We are invincible right now. The worst, most toxic bug at the moment in the game is on the scavenger shell bot. You may know about it, you may not, but I'm going to be showing you guys. And I know a bunch of you are probably wondering, why am I showing it to you if some players are going to see this and then take advantage of it? I think, I believe showing you guys is a better idea because then you guys can shame the people that are taking advantage of it. And then you also know not to use the scavenger shell until it's fixed. So... We're going to try out two different shell bots here, and I'm going to see if it applies to the Dread Shell. I don't think so, but I'm going to show you guys exactly how this bug works and why not to use the shell bot and shame everyone that uses it and knows about it. So let's get into a game here. The Drew Tompkins Legendary Pilot, but it doesn't really matter. Here we go. Okay, we're here on Dreadnought, and let's first drop in the Dread Shell. So... This dread, oh, it's lagging out here. Okay, this shell bot here. Okay, we're moving to center. And let's see if this one works perfectly. Of course, we should be able to deal out damage normally and take damage because that's how every robot is supposed to work. Um, but let's see how it actually works out. We're already, we're already taking a bit of damage there. I don't know what's going on. Okay, we're going with the dread shell because, of course, the dread shell. Okay, let's shoot this Hiroshi. The Dread Shell is a special edition shell bot as well. Um, okay, Ooh, we just cleared out center. Okay, we're getting center here. I'm really liking this Puncher Shredder build too. It's very effective. You lock down and the punchers do a ton of damage. Here we go, here we go. Oh, he's lagging out a bit, but I think we got him. Okay, he's hitting into our shield, so obviously we're not going to take really damage until he breaks through our shield. Okay, he didn't even really shoot us, so we couldn't really tell if it's bugged out or not on this one. Come on, somebody shoot me. And how I understand it, and how I've seen it before, is the scavenger shell doesn't take damage. Kill, there we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, okay, this harpy is shredding through our shields. Whoa, okay, that's definitely damaging him. We're rotating our shields right now. Okay, we were definitely taking some damage there, and then we healed up. But that's a good thing, surprisingly, because that's what we're trying to focus on. Come on, help me. Okay, we cleared up the center here. And the shell bot is honestly just a worse revenant, but it's still a very good robot. So if you have a shell bot and don't have a revenant, I would highly recommend the shell. Not the scavenger shell, though, and I'm going to show you guys soon. Just hang in there while we use up this robot. Yeah, see, we're taking damage. Everything seems normal. This seems like it's working how it's supposed to. Okay, our last stand is triggered. Whoa! Bunch of guys dropping. They're dropping in their whole team here. Uh, okay, we got taken out. Okay, time for the scavenger shell. So I'm not going to abuse this. I'm not going to run like 30 games with the scavenger shell. I'm literally doing this to show you guys what's wrong with it. And to have that work, I need players to shoot at me. Because it's not an increase in damage, it's us taking damage. Okay, we killed that guy. Didn't get a chance there. So we pretty much need an enemy to to go through our shields, and then, then we can see whether or not... We have a four beacon cap. Hopefully, we can get this. We almost want our shields to get broken, so we can really test this thing out. Oh, we just... Whoa! Boom, double kill. That was a super torch. Okay. See, this guy's shooting into our physical shields. We can't tell yet, really, if we're taking damage. We need our shields broken. Break our shields, Fabnir. Okay, we... Yeah, we can't really do anything there. Like I said, I don't know if it's all weapons. I don't know if it's... No weapons? I don't know if... I know Pixonic hasn't fixed the bug yet, but I know they're... They are fixing it. And this is a pretty bad bad bug. I've seen a lot of people use it lately, and that's why I'm kind of making this video. Is because I've seen a lot of players on the battlefield, triple kill, use this bug to their advantage. And it's a complete trolling, griefing the server move. So do not do it. It's a soy boy move. Okay. Um, I okay, are any of our physical shields blown off yet? This may turn into a close game. Oh my gosh, all these luchadors out here. Okay, I think this is a luchador too. Okay, this is a luchador. Let's... Oh, he just jumped away. All right. 
Somebody come and kill me, man! Okay, here, here is an Arthur. Okay, our, our physical shield must be blown off. We are taking damage though right now. We are taking damage 100% right now. Okay, our health is going down. That seemed pretty normal. That seemed pretty ordinary that we were taking health. So let's now try... Let's see what happens if we shoot... Or sorry, if we use our ability while we're getting shot. Does that make a difference? What's this guy doing? Why isn't he shooting at us? Why isn't he shooting at us? Come on! He's AFK. Bro, he's AFK. Okay, that was a free kill. Free damage. Okay, come on. We have to be able to get shot at a little bit here. Okay, we're in this guy's cinder. And we are definitely taking damage. Titan Slayer. We were taking damage there. Man, I hope this... I mean, if you guys are seeing this video, it means that I found the bug. Double kill. Oh, well, offer Orion there. So if you're seeing this video, it means the bug is coming, and I'm going to show you guys. But it's not all the time. That's pretty interesting. Um, here we go. We're torching this enemy shell bot up. I wonder if he's a shell bot, a scavenger shell. Mm, doesn't look like it. I'm not sure. Why is he just running away from us? This guy is really just running away from us. Okay, last stand triggered. Last stand is triggered. Triple kill. There we go. Okay, this is a Favnir. Finally, maybe he can shoot at us. Right now. Right now. Look. While we're using our ability, his shots are going straight through us and we're not taking any damage. And now we're invincible. We are invincible right now. We are taking zero damage from his shots. See how dumb this is? I'm not doing anything. I'm going to dish this thing. But you guys saw that. Replay it if you have to. But we were not taking any damage whatsoever. After he was shooting at us while we activated our ability. And then it was just stuck like that. So it's really weird. Okay. Game is over. We're going to run one more game and try to get this thing to show you guys another time. But that is the problem. So if you're shooting at a scavenger shell bot and you're not... Or you're not dealing any damage. Your weapon's going straight through. That is why. Let's go one more game. Here we go. Okay, we're now here on Moon Map. And let's go Dread 1. Let's go Dread first here. So if you're in the game and you're shooting at a shell bot. And you can't tell what's, what special edition or maybe it's a weird skin. And the weapons are going straight through the robot. And you're not dealing any damage. That is why. It's because of this bug. And usually these bugs, I like I see some bugs in the game, but this one seems to be a pretty big deal when robots are becoming invincible. <laughs> oh geez, this is a Kepri here. Um okay, hold on, hold on. Last in triggered. Man, we might be able to take out this Kepri. This Kepri should be able to Boom! Kill we just absolutely blew that guy up. We blew him up! Okay, come on. Uh, double kill, double kill. Double kill. Triple kill, nice. See the shell bot without the bug, obviously. Don't use the bugged out scavenger. Um, but it's a very rampage. It's a very good build if you're running it properly with the right weapons and modules. Okay, godlike. We just got a godlike not even two minutes into this game with the shell bot. And I'm constantly looking up at my health bar when we're getting shot. And this robot does not look bugged out. It really seems like it's only the scavenger bot. Which is weird. Living Legend. Honestly, since it's not fixed yet with the scavenger shell. I would have thought that Pixonic would just remove the scavenger shell for a bit or something. Because it's really just a special edition of the shell bot. It's not like it's every version of the shell. Living Legend again. What is going on? We've got double living legends with this shell bot that keep dropping in on this beacon. The shell bot is literally the halberd on steroids. And oh, didn't get him. 
Okay, we finally got taken out there. Man, we were causing absolute chaos there. Now bugged out scav shell. So it looks like we have a friendly... We got another teammate shell bot going forward. Whoa! So we've already taken damage. So it only gets triggered the bug when you do certain things. So it's almost like once if you're being shot at and then you hit your ability. That's what it seemed like before. So let's wait for it. These physical shields are going to protect us either way. So we kind of need to take some damage first. Okay, see we're being shot at right now. We're being shot at. And our ability is going. See, that's really weird. I think we're taking damage from some of the weapons, but not others. That's super weird. Let's see now. Man, it's so hard to tell. It's like the rocket weapons cause damage to us, but then the energy weapons don't. Yeah, th this guy is definitely causing damage to us right now, which is so weird. So it's a very particular bug. That's probably why it's taking so long for people to realize it. And I don't know how long this bug has existed, but I think it's been a while. So if you don't know about it, this video is for you. See, look, his, his cinder are hitting us. That is whack. Okay, we finally died there. He finally died. Okay, let's drop in. Let's win this game, even though we're all bugged out here. So that was really weird. His The Luchador with Cataclysm was going through us, but then the Cinder were damaging us. So it seems like certain energy, maybe bullet weapons, don't damage that shell, that Scavenger shell, but rocket weapons and Cinder do. So that's something to look out for if you're facing a Scavenger shell and do not promote this, people using this bug. You know it's just an absolute troll and... Yeah, just don't use it. It's just dumb. It's just... I don't know if it's considered cheating or what it is, but it's not good. Whew. Uh-oh, we're taking some damage here. Man, I'm... This Aljun Smuda... I've seen a bunch of players on the battlefield using this, and... I don't know if they saw my video using it, but it is very deadly. It definitely brings back the Aljun for sure. Come on, we almost got him. Oh, we didn't get the kill there. Okay, guys, we're just... Ooh, the peaking bar is changing a lot here. Okay. And there we go. Boom. All right, guys, that wraps it up. So we tried a normal... A dread shell and the scavenger shell. And this only applies to the scavenger shell. Tell people not to use their scavenger shells until this bug is fixed. It is just nonsense. You guys saw it. It is literally an invincibility bug against certain weapons. All right, guys. Until next time, peace. Spaghetti-o sandwich. Make sure to subscribe. See you guys next time.